Good afternoon everyone. I wanted to talk to you about some heifers that I have that I'm going to be selling. This little group of heifers are all about 15 to 16 months of age. They're half South Pole and half Angus Cross. And I'm going to show you this group uh, and then we're going to talk about another couple of, of uh, heifer calves that we have for sale. So stay tuned. So this group of heifers, like I said, are out of uh, my Angus Cross cows and a South Pole bull. And there's a few pretty good heifers in here. Um, things that I'm not embarrassed to show you on camera. There's probably a cull here or there. But I will let y'all be the judge of that. These cows, or these heifers, are exposed to a Greg Judy bull. And this is the Greg Judy bull that I purchased from Greg in June of this year. He's a two-year-old bull. And I'm going to show you how thick he is. But look at these heifers. they got a good gut on them. Um, the gut is the rumen, and that is what is the fermentation vat. This little black heifer looking at me right there. I think she's the poorest of the group and probably needs to be culled. But she probably will grow out and be an okay cow. I know she'll be an okay cow. She just doesn't have quite the look that I'm looking for. Um, but these others are not bad. Um, that white one is half Longhorn and half South Pole. And she's not for sale. Um, a neighbor is going to take her and then this Brahma heifer is not for sale she belongs to the neighbor whose property I'm using um, to run these heifers on and I'm thankful that he's allowing me to use use his property and improve his property so this is what I got 15 to 16 months old exposed to the Greg Judy bull and look how thick and how big his gut is I mean this sucker is wide and he is a grass eating machine <clears throat> and the other thing about him is he's got excellent libido I mean something comes in heat and he is all over them very gentle he's going to produce gentle uh, pass that trade on to to his calves these heifers are all very gentle um, they are not at all worried about me being amongst them. They are hot wire broke. And to the extent, and again, this is the poorest of the bunch in my opinion. Um, doesn't have much gut, a lot of leg. I'll probably take her to the sale barn, but she'll make somebody an okay, an okay cow. Um, but look at the gut on those. I think they're pretty correct and I like them. Um, that one has a bit of a navel. I don't care for that but that's again some of the uh, Brahma influence uh, upstream of her. And like I said some of these some of these heifers are spoken for. Um, I'm gonna price them at $950 a head and I'm not I'm not going to sell them as confirmed pregnant, but um, as exposed. So if you buy them, um, hopefully they'll be pregnant. They will have been exposed to the bull 60 days in the middle of November. And so I think we've, we've seen the bull breed on most of them. So I'm pretty sure most of them are going to be pregnant. So this is what I got. I want you to see them. Um, they're a nice little group of heifers. 
again four of them are definitely spoken for um, the red one this one with the navel and two others but they're grass eating machines and they will be a good starting place for somebody that's looking for the South Pole influence and we'll I'm going to go to another pasture and show you some more younger heifers that are for sale so here's the daddy to all the heifers that you will see today he's a full blood south pole four years old i don't like his head really well a little bit too feminine for me but he's an okay bull and he's done a good job for me he breeds about 50 head of, 50 head of, drive you insane 50 head of cows a year and he's been spot on so that's the daddy but the second group I want to want you to see they're just two heifers in this group these are February calves and they're good ones this little heifer right here she's out of a really good mama actually that's her mama she's standing beside she's she's weaned not sucking but it's interesting to watch these calves. They will go buddy up with their mama and stay with their mama if they stay on the place and their buds the rest of their life. So I think this heifer is very feminine. I like her head a lot. Um, she's bigger in the tail end than the front end. She sloped downhill. Um, she's got all the right parts. She's got a good gut on her, so she's gonna eat grass and ferment it and provide herself with the nutrition she needs and she's just a dandy really like her and then i'll find this last one and show you her so let me walk through here and figure that out but here's these cows they're just happy as a clam good good set of black cows for sure but as i keep alluding to we're going to go straight south pole once we get enough of a foothold to really go that way so stay tuned let me find that heifer so here she is and that's her mom right beside her and again they're weaned they're no longer sucking but they they pal around with their moms they know each other love each other and they'll be pals as long as they stay on on the same property together but this is a nice nice heifer i really like the black baldy type and she's built right she's gonna have a really good udder her mama has a really good udder um, this is a nice nice heifer and both of these two heifers are february 2021 heifers um, got a good gut on her this is going to be a dandy and so i'm glad you're able to see the moms beside the babies you get an appreciation for what you'll get downstream um, once these heifers calve and and how this these cows maintain their body condition so that's what i got in these two heifers i'm are february 2021 and i'm pricing them at 850 dollars so we'll go on to the third bunch. So this is likely to be a little noisy. This is a group of calves that I just weaned. Pulled them off the cows. Pulled them off the cows yesterday. These are May calves. And this is a good little heifer here. That white one is, believe it or not, half South Pole and a quarter Angus cross and a quarter Longhorn that's her mama right there and she's a pretty nice looking little calf from the perspective of body style she's gonna make somebody a really good cow um, and again <coughs> she's half South Pole heifer right beside her is half South Pole Angus cross and then I got some bull calves Two of them are spoken for as far as somebody's going to use them to breed some 
cows, and then this is the third heifer of the bunch, and she's a nice heifer. So these heifers are just now going to be weaned. I'll keep them in the lot till they start stop bawling, and I'm going to get them on a little bit of feed. <clears throat> and again, just to try to keep a little condition on them while they're going through the bawling process. Um, I typically don't feed anything unless it's the bed of winter. And that's a half south pole half Angus cross. And he dang sure looks all south pole. So that's what I got. So I got a couple of bull calves if somebody was interested in them. And then I got these three heifers. And I'm going to price these heifers at $750 a piece. So three sets of heifer calves. I've got the uh, exposed heifers that we first looked at. Then I've got the two weaned heifers that are February 2021. Uh, birth dates and then these three calves these three heifer calves here that are um, May 2021 birth dates so that's what I got if you're interested you can email me email me at southpolecows at gmail.com southpolecows at gmail.com and I'll be glad to visit with you about it. I appreciate y'all watching. I appreciate all the support for my channel and I hope you're enjoying the cows as much as I do and I'll gradually transition to totally south pole and uh, try to keep the videos coming of things that I think are interesting and things I'm, I'm learning as I go and again i'm most appreciative of you guys staying hooked up with me thanks again